Hi guys, I'm your pontiff, Archibald Chesterfield III, AC3, and today guys I'm making a video, and this is in response to another YouTuber, my good friend Barkin' Jack, and he recently made a video, I think it was more of a advertorial than a video, he made an advertorial video on purchasing his next watch, and he mentions that he bought it on Fleabay, eBay, eBay. And he mentions how that now Fleabay has got special protections where they will authenticate the watches. And I'd like to make this video because I'm a little bit skeptical. To be completely honest with you, I am a little bit skeptical with eBay themselves and I, I want to make this video and just give you my opinion uh, before we start this video let's do a quick wrist watch check I'm wearing a Rolex steel submariner Rolex steel submariner this is a submariner beautiful submariner now guys let's what's happened is eBay in their infinite wisdom now gets watches verified they say they've got a panel of experts who will check the pieces for authenticity before you get them and whilst this sounds really cool and wonderful i gotta tell you ebay has never really been that great let me tell you this, eBay has been a cesspot for fakes and butchered timepieces and I'm really a bit cynical. I've got to tell you this, I think the eBay program itself, it doesn't deal with a couple major flaws. For a start, eBay themselves there, have you ever tried to ring eBay? or to talk to someone at Fleabay. And <clears throat> I gotta tell you, in all honesty, eBay itself there, it promotes itself as this trading platform. Well, you try and ringing them. If you've got a problem, you need to talk to them. Uh, that ain't really an option. eBay is this uh, sort of big trading platform, which really, Mass the names of any staff, any authenticity experts. And I've also got to tell you, it really concerns me that they would be putting themselves up as experts. If anything eBay's done in the past, eBay uses the cheapest means possible. So I got to be honest with you, how good are these authenticators? Hi guys, Archie Luxury, and who do I recommend in America? In America, who do I recommend for quality pre-owned wristwatches? David SW, David SW, David SW. Go to davidsw.com. He is the best, the greatest pre-owned dealer in all of the United States of America. David SW, David SW, David SW. <laughs> I gotta be honest with you, with eBay, it's one size fits all. I tried to research a bit of information about this eBay authentication program, authentic, the eBay authenticity guarantee. So I went into eBay, I went into their help section, and it gave me documents on eBay authentication for sneakers. That's right, for sneakers. That's right, one size fits all, Bubba. One size fits all. And whilst it's all comforting to know that the these sneakers I bought on eBay are genuine and used, I don't really like one size fits all for expensive luxury timepieces. And typical eBay, eBay bullshit. Let me tell you a couple things about eBay. One size fits all. It's kind of like Big Brother, except more nastier with higher fees. 
the thing is this. So basically, items are automatically put in this authenticity program. Wristwatches over two thousand dollars, I believe, is the cutoff. And what's going to happen is you get it gets sent. The seller sends it to an authenticity expert or center. Knowing eBay, it'd probably be, you know, somebody they've got on contract, someone who's done a stupid course with these jokers, who then becomes the expert. Let me tell you something. Authenticating watches is bloody hard. I know many, many watch dealers in business who have made fike ups. Even myself, I have made fike ups. So I just imagine these minimum wage workers that eBay's hired, they've done a, a, uh, a workshop, and now they're authentication experts. I don't want these goons putting their mitts on anything that I'm selling, that's for sure. And I gotta tell you, what are they gonna do? They're gonna open the back? They're gonna check the movement? So if you, any sort of, uh, Rolex, Rolex watch, you'd want to open the back, open the back, and then you've voided the seals, and it may not be waterproof then. So is that what eBay, I, I don't understand this, to be completely honest with you, eBay, one size fits all, you know what, I wouldn't be trusting eBay as far as I can throw them. Let me tell you this, the other great thing about eBay is, try looking this shit up on their site. It's, you go to their help section, it's one size fits all. It is, uh, and how do you contact the auth authenticator? And just out of interest there, say the authenticator says, no, it's not real, and you have proof it is, well, there's no, there's, you can't go backwards and forwards, eBay's decision is final. So I've got to be totally honest with you, eBay, man, I would say, man, I'd think you're better off to get in touch with a dealer you can trust. A dealer like David SW, David SW, David SW, or Pride and Pinion. You want to go to a serious dealer you can trust. I really wouldn't be buying shit off eBay. Let me give you the drum. I don't think that is where I would be shopping for value or, you know, for my purchases. And it might be okay. For sneakers, eBay might be okay to buy sneakers from Fleabay, but I gotta tell you something, guys. I don't know if this one size fits all model is really great for watches. And I tried to do some research on it, and uh, I gotta tell you, I wasn't real happy with what came up here eBay launches authentication on all watches sold for 2000 uh or more in the u.s and they're doing it in a number of site number of markets there i gotta be honest with you who the hell is ebay using to authenticate this can you contact them i don't really like this i gotta be totally honest with you ebay one size fits all and uh i i uh you're much better off to get in touch with a dealer. eBay charges high fees, high commissions. eBay charges, charges, charges. eBay makes it seem like, how can I say this? You know, I watched the Bark and Jack video, and it's like an ad for EasyJet or Jetstar, you know, a very low-cost carrier. And I got to tell you, he's cool and hip. He's got the nice plants in the backyard growing there. But you know what? I wouldn't trust eBay as far as I can spit. That's right. eBay, I don't fucking trust you. I don't trust you in the least. And I gotta tell you, as the Pontiff, I wouldn't be buying watches off Fleabay. Fleabay is okay to buy my sneakers. Sneakers. But I'm, I'm not one of buying watches from Fleabay, that's for sure. You're much better off. Get in touch with a dealer. Get a dealer in your own country and buy a watch from somebody you can trust. Not necessarily the cheapest, but somebody you can trust. I gotta be honest with you, eBay's one size fits all. I've seen this shit in the past. eBay, I don't like it. I don't like it 
I don't like it. In fact, who do I ring? Is there a phone number? Can you talk to somebody at Flea Bay? No, no. It's it's like dealing. It's it's one notch up from Craigslist. I think it's fraught with danger. I think eBay are a bunch of assholes. That's what I think. I'm the pontiff. I think they're assholes. I wouldn't be buying. I wouldn't be buying expensive watches. Sneakers, used sneakers, maybe. But I wouldn't be buying a um, a Rolex Submariner off eBay. I wouldn't be buying that off eBay, dudes. I'd be getting a good dealer. Okay, guys, I'm Archie Luxury. Tell me what you think. Like, subscribe, tell your friends. And I will see you in the next one. Hey, guys, check out my one of my best friends, Jamie Opulence, on YouTube. Just go to Jamie Opulence on YouTube. A fantastic travel, a fantastic channel from my good friend, Jamie. Check it out, guys. Hey guys, Archie Luxury. Guys, I want to introduce a new service to you. ValueYourWatch.com. Proud supporters of Archie Luxury. No seller's fees. No buyer's fees. That's right, guys. This is a trading platform to buy or sell watches. You can start selling for free. That's right. Uh, we advertise our paying... For, for our paying sub subscribers on Google, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn. It's a global platform. That's right, guys. Get $50 off the annual subscription by applying the coupon Archie when you check in there. But, guys, you can try this for free straight away. Guys, you can start listing watches. ValueYourWatch.com Give it a try and tell me what you guys think of that. Subscribe and tell your friends and don't be afraid to get a paid review. 50 US dollars for a paid review. It helps me stay full time on YouTube and I will see you in the next one. 50 US dollars paid review. I can't survive on Google Ads. I need your support. And guys, you could also sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon allows you to pay as little as a dollar a month to keep me on YouTube. Hey guys, Archie Luxury, who do I recommend for watches in Brisbane and Sydney? Vintage Watch Co, that's correct. Vintage Watch Co in Brisbane Arcade in Brisbane and the Strand Arcade in Sydney. Vintage Watch Co, Brisbane and Sydney. Ronnie, I've known him since the late 90s. Ronnie is a top bloke. Luke is a great guy. Vintage Watch Co. That is who I recommend in Australia. Check out Vintage Watch Co. and the guys. Amazing range of watches. They also do service and repairs. Vintage Watch Co. That is where the pontiff goes. You know, some of my paddocks came from Vintage Watch Co. That's right, guys. Vintage Watch Co.